Battling wind and rustiness, Tiger Woods feels good in return to action. During any normal golf tournament, the words on the tee, Tiger Woods are usually followed by rapturous applause from the gathered crowd. But with no fans currently permitted to attend PGA Tour events to avoid spreading COVID-19 Woods return to competitive action was met by silence at the Memorial Tournament in Dublin, Ohio. Playing in his first competitive PGA Tour event since the Genesis Tournament in February, the lack of atmosphere proved the least of Woods' problems. On a blustery day, the 44-year-old struggled with winds exceeding 30 miles per hour and the rustiness that comes with five months away from competitive action to card a 1 under 71 and finish five shots behind leader Tony Fino. Despite having to battle those different elements, Woods said he felt good after completing his round. It felt good. I was a little bit rusty but felt like overall it was a good start. It has been a while since I have played. Got off to almost an ideal start and got a feel for the round early. I just did not make anything today. I had looks at birdies, but I really did not make much, he said afterwards. I was very pleased the way I drove it my feel for my irons. I just did not quite hit the putts hard enough. Most of my putts were dying, did not quite have enough oomph to it. Read, there is not enough black people in golf, says Lee Westwood. Woods plays his third shot on the 11th hole during the first round of the Memorial Tournament. A different atmosphere. While the reception he might have normally got on the first tee was different, Woods did not let the lack of atmosphere show, birdieing the first hole. The energy was not the same without the fans. That certainly was noticeable, mostly different, said Woods, who has won this tournament a record five times. But no I definitely did not have any issue with energy and not having the fans' reactions out there. I still felt the same eagerness, edginess, nerviness starting out, and it was good. It was a good feel. I have not felt this in a while. Woods putts on the fifth green as McElroy, top, and Koipka, bottom. Look on. Woods' round was not completely silent though. As his group along with major champions Rory McIlroy and Brooks Koipka walked down the opening hole, some young fans voiced their support from over their fences. A group of children three of which had painted their faces in tiger stripes on the 11th hole stood on chairs to watch the group. They brandished a sign reading Tiger's Cub House and chanted Go Tiger, eliciting a smile and a wave from Woods. Woods can break Sam Snead's 55-year-old record of 82 PGA Tour wins if he wins this week. He will have to catch Fino to claim that elusive 83rd win though. The American finished with seven birdies over his last ten holes to close out with a six under 66. World number one McElroy is four shots behind Fino, while US Open champion Gary Woodland is just two off the lead.